The Engineering Research Center program at the National Science Foundation are, are, are fairly large grants. The way the NSF runs it is the first five years are, are guaranteed, and that's uh, $18.5 million from NSF for the first five years of operation. The center that we have is, is the National Science Foundation Engineering Research Center for Bioreneable Chemicals. And the industry that we're looking at transforming is the industrial chemical market. Uh, the industrial chemical market is doesn't get nearly as much play as fuels, uh, but comes from the same feedstock. So you start with crude oil. While most of crude oil ends up in fuels, about 8% of a barrel ends up uh, in, in petrochemicals. And those chemicals are things that touch our lives everywhere. Uh, the things that are most noticeable to us are plastics, whether it be the toys that uh, our children play with or the bottles that we put uh, water in, uh, but also cosmetics, um, uh, antifreeze, uh, a lot of things that we take for granted in our day-to-day -day operation are also based on crude oil. And so the focus of the center is trying to move to a more sustainable source of carbon for those chemicals that have become integral to our society. There needs to be a lead institution in which, in, in this case, Iowa State University serves, serves that role, but we have partner schools from around the country. And then we also have two institutions in Europe that are international partners. These are very large efforts, and, and you really have to have the right environment created with which to, to nurture it. And we had so many pieces already in place at Iowa State uh, to create the center, and really having that infrastructure in place in my view, was seminally important to being successful. One of the important attributes of, of this Engineering Research Center is we feel it takes Iowa State from the situation of having a strong presence in biorenewables uh, to one of really a leadership position uh, both nationally and internationally in, in biorenewable chemicals.